Hey, 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 Taurus. This is your sacred scribe here, ready to do your Tuesday, July 28th to the 29th. Intuitive Love Tarot read. This is for my Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, and North Node. This will not resonate with everybody, of course, but hopefully it will with you guys today. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Right down below there, Taurus, before you leave. I do appreciate it. And thank you so much for all of your likes, shares, and subscriptions. If you guys are interested in a personal reading with me, that way this is more specific to you and your needs and your questions, the information can be found in the description box below. I'm going to get a channeled message here, Taurus, in just one moment. But first, let me get some cards. Don't forget to comment. Let me know if this resonates with you, Taurus. Interesting. Okay. All right. We got the Five of Swords, Taurus. The Four of Wands. The Page of Wands. In the Six of Cups. At the bottom of the deck, we have the Hermit. So, interesting. Let's get uh, this message from Spirit. Okay, they're saying take yourself outside of the equation. I'm not sure what equation they're referring to. I'm, I feel like it's like take yourself outside of the box type thing and try to, and this is regarding a situation. Is that what you mean by equation? Okay. Look at it as if you're an outsider. And whatever situation is coming to you at this time, they're saying that's the situation that they're talking about. So they want you to be an observer of whatever it is instead of looking at it from being inside, right? They just said, seek what you lost. What did you lose, Taurus? I always pray to St. Anthony if I lose something, but it, I do. It actually works. Seriously, he answers me like 98% of the time. No, more like 99. I just say, whatever's lost, right? I say, St. Anthony, St. Anthony, what was lost now is found. I always find it, whether it be keys, whether it be anything. Is that it? Okay, thank you. All right, so try to, whatever situation came to your mind, Taurus, try to think about it as a spectator rather than somebody who's playing the game, so to speak, right? Whatever that game is. So, Taurus, what do you got going on here? Hmm. Somebody is lying. We're going to find out what they're lying about, but I feel like somebody around you is lying. It it now it's it's above the 4 of wands here and 4 is 4 of wands has to do with stability, family. It could be somebody in your family. It could be a lie about somebody in your family. It could be, well, it could be a twin flame because it is a four of wands. Somebody, this could be somebody from childhood, Taurus. Is that them? Okay, somebody's watching you, Taurus. Tell me about the five of swords. Yeah, somebody's lying about money. Ten of Pentacles. That has to do with abundance. What about money? That has to do... Yep, it could be an Aries, could be a Leo. Okay. Hmm. 
This could be somebody that you had a family with because Ten of Pentacles is marriage. So you may have to make a decision, Taurus. Knight of Pentacles. Hmm. I feel like you're gonna you're you're gonna respond here, Taurus, but you're gonna do it smart. You're gonna take your time because the Knight of Pentacles is the slowest knight in the deck, but he always arrives there, he or she, right? Tell me about the Four of Wands. Yep, starting drama, Five of Wands. Hmm, now Nine of Cups has to do with a wish. Is it Taurus's wish? <laughs> okay, Taurus, they're saying that they think they're like taking this wish away, right? By causing this drama. And I'm laughing because they're laughing and they're like, they, they, they have no idea. And they're doing it out of jealousy with the five of swords there of this wish and it's something that they're seeing ace of pentacles is some sort of opportunity that is coming to you now there is a past life soulmate that you're also going to meet but i'm also feeling there is a money opportunity coming towards you yeah see you've got a new love ace of wands and a new money opportunity coming towards you and this person, I told you, this person is watching you. And it's somebody from the past. Could be somebody, like I said, you were married to, had a long-term relationship with somebody with the Ten of Pentacles there and the Emperor, okay? Trying to control something, but th th they have no idea. They, they truly feel that um, they're doing something that's going to shake you up, so to speak, and it doesn't you respond and you're like okay do my response and then you just keep moving right you're not letting it shake you you're not letting it yeah see you're balanced you remain balanced you're like okay a little bit of change gotta go to take a left that's it you're embracing change sagittarius energy so this you've got three fives here it may be a little bit unexpected but you're going with it it's like okay it's a it's a speed bump where they feel it's like a tower moment that's what i'm feeling and they're saying yep yep and it's not they think it is but it's not that's funny two of swords yeah you're seeing this for what it is two of cups make sure you don't and I clarify hmm. this could be a Libra or a Taurus a fellow Taurus but this is you Taurus or somebody else this Emperor because now you have the Emperor and the Empress so you definitely could have been married to this person okay Okay, and this is what they, they feel that, <laughs> they feel Taurus, and I'm sorry, they, they, this is just funny. They feel Taurus that you can't see something, right? And what they don't know is you don't give a shit. That's what they don't know, and they don't realize when they think you do. They think you do, they think that they're messing with some sort of wish that they think you have i don't whatever they think your wish is um it's not preventing it because the universe what's meant for you will always be there for you and nobody can change that nobody can take that from you so it doesn't matter it's like 
going um, going on a road trip, right, Taurus? And you've got 10 different ways of getting there, but you're still going to get there. Now, one may take you two hours longer, one may be quicker, but it's all going to the same destination. And that's what they're saying, because I feel like whatever this wish is that they feel that you have, one, I don't feel that they know the whole story or the whole wish, if you will, right? Um, but two, they, they are not aware, they just said, of the divine plan. So whatever your wish is, it has to do with the divine plan. And nobody's going to fuck with the divine plan. So nice try. I don't know what to tell you, Taurus. And you've got love coming. It could be somebody from the past. The devil energy. Could be a Capricorn. Okay. Let me clarify this. Okay. You may get more than one offer here. Because you get the Six of Cups, the Two of Cups, the Ace of Pentacles, Wands, the Devil card, and the Queen of Cups. So somebody's coming back to express their love, right? Make sure you use your intuition regarding this. But I feel like there's more than one offer. I feel like there's two offers. So what is this person's intention? This, um, the six of cups? Six of cups? No? The two of cups. Two of cups. King of wands. Could be an Aries Leo Sagittarius. Yeah, be careful, Taurus. Three of Cups and the King of Swords. They could automatically, this could be a third party situation. So be careful that you're seeing it for what it is. Okay, because you're going to have, there is another opportunity. Tell me about the Six of Cups. I feel like the Six of Cups, Ace of Swords and the page of cups you're getting an offer and you're going to be clear about which offer you're going to take it's going to be one of the past and one of the present so you're going to see this for what it is you're going to see the two of cups this person and i feel this is the devil with the queen of cups tell me about the devil yeah, this is somebody that you walked away from with the Eight of Cups here. Oops. King of Pentacles could be a Taurus Virgo Capricorn and the Ten of Cups. Okay. I f you know what I feel like, Taurus? Somebody sees your, your wishes coming true and they try to come in and fuck it up. And they don't. They're not able to. Advice, advice, justice, twin flame card, but also karmic balance. This is all karmic balance. So whatever is happening, uh, go with the flow. <laughs> They're saying yes. Go with the flow because it's all going to be balanced out and it's all going to be good. So listen to your intuition. Four of Pentacles. Hang on to your money as well with the Four of Pentacles. So you may want to save Taurus with the Four of Pentacles here. And see, didn't I say in the beginning, they said that you can't mess with divine destiny. This is divine, divine destiny. Whatever you're doing, whatever this wish is or whatever you will be doing, Whatever this wish has to do with, okay, is bringing you the Ten of Cups anyway, but this is your destiny, so it, it won't change. It won't change, so just trust in that, okay? Three of Swords. So make sure that you're healing right now, and you're prepared for this to come in. 
because that's what's going to happen, Taurus. Make sure that you're healed and that you're not stuck in this position and you're not blinding yourself to what is truly going on. Because I feel the person coming back is somebody who had a th third party situation before and they still do. All right, Taurus, I hope this helped. Please drop a like below, share, and subscribe if you already haven't. If you're interested in a personal reading with me, the information can be found in the description box below. Don't forget to like, share, and comment, and subscribe. Have a good one, Taurus, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Namaste.